yes so dear friends i'm going to share one page uh, through the page i'm going to share how to calculate the uh, calculation of any top product uh, manual how to calculate the conversion manually see that ne one neat product is a neat t-shirt of a ladies t-shirt and measurement sheet is given here uh, this is spec sheet this is called spec sheet uh, and uh, this is called measurement sheet and from the measurement sheet here i have put here a uh, uh, size i mean half chest what is half chest uh, the or a uh, half bottom which one is getter you have to put here i mean half chest and half bottom which, uh, between this two which one is getter we have to consider that one then body length sleeve length allowance gsm and the, everything required is here and if we go the measurement here see measurement is given here first of all have to see that say the measurement is given in cm or in or in ins so here uh, consider the measurement is given in cm uh, so in this case the formula is uh, for neat product we have to keep in mind this formula half says uh half chest or bottom which is getter we have to put here multiply two uh, if we multiply two we'll get the full chest i mean this full full round chest we'll get if we multiply two then uh, that is width side and then we have to take the length side see here uh, uh length uh, oh one thing is that with this uh, chest i have to keep some allowance that is uh, allowances then length and silly length or length will be added i mean this total length then sleeve length plus allowances plus uh, multiply gsm i mean what the gsm uh, of this fabric as well as you have to divide by the 100 100 then 1000 so why 100 100 1000 just here if you see here uh, what is the half chest half chest is here in half chest is here see 43.6 and half bottom if i go for uh, half bottom is here c46 yet i have con we have considered here medium size because there are five size so we are considering the medium size or to be in safe side if we be in uh, if we consider length will be more safe side so see uh, between the half chest and uh, uh, bottom hem the bottom hem is uh, greater i mean uh, 46 that's why you, that's why here we have considered 46 cm then body length 64.0 cm body length is c.5 so here if we go 0.5 it means here 64.2 so here 64.2 same way sleeve length if go sleeve length that is 0 0.12 0 0.12 is 15.9 so here see 15.9 so here <coughs> we have got body length uh, chest body length sleeve length then see allowances this allowances and this allowances about l allowances see here would have considered for chest or hem 3 cm what about it is uh, uh, for width wise consider here allowance 3 and for this length and sleeve for this length uh, see uh, this length even though there is bottom hem and there is also swing in top side so uh, here would be allowances and here would also should have some allowances that's why here uh, this allowances uh, 3cm as well as if we go the sleeve sleeve also that you see there is sleeve hem and there is also uh, there is cut and sew joining there so there is also need some allowances that's why here uh, if you see allowances 3 plus 3 i mean for sleeve length 3 and body length 3 so here we have put all the measurement sheet see here chest chest uh, sorry uh, bottom hem bottom hem we have put, put, we got 46 so 46 multiplied to it is 92 so we put here 92 plus allowances 3 then see uh, 64 is uh, body length then plus sleeve length is 15.9 then these two allowances i mean one for body length another for sleeve length then uh, say this concept we have considered the fabric of the this gsm 160 gsm then put 160 gsm and divide by 100 100 1000 now why 100 100 and 1000 yes as measurement is given here cm with cm length also cm so to convert this with cm to cm to meter by divide by 100 the same way the length cm by meter to make it meter 100 and the gsm is means gram see here gram per square meter this gram per square meter if we divide this gram by 1000 say here meter meter I mean square meter we are getting here and this gram if we divide by 1000 automatically we we'll get the kg i mean kilogram so this way if you put all the value here automatically you will get the result and you know at the time uh, uh, always we do the consumption in dozen basis <coughs> uh, not in piece basis uh, it's the um, always we do the uh, consumption in dozen basis that's why have multiplied by 12 
so here uh, it's it's easy calculation after doing this calculation we will get one point you will get 1.56 kg per dozen consumption of this product uh, of this uh, t uh, t shirt but you see we have calculated the body but there is a neck binding is there also we have to do the calculation of neck binding and this neck binding yeah we have, it's uh, for this sort of neck binding consumption is coming actually 0 0.07 0 0.08 0 0.09 like this so here we have considered 0 0.08 neck binding and total the net consumption is coming 1.64 but you know for the costing we have to add some uh, more because you know at the cutting time uh, there are some uh, lots of wastes cutting part and uh, in cat section also there are uh, marker efficiency you know might be marker marker efficiency more or less and there are some cutting wastes as well as uh, have to plan also some extra shipment considering all if we put six or seven percent wastes that would be fine that's why here we have considered six percent and the final consumption we have got 1.73 kg per dozen uh, for this product so it's okay uh, that's all uh, for same basis and if the same calculation uh, i mean measurement sheet uh, is uh, given by the inch basis see if i go, go space here if it is given by inch basis everything would be same just in the you have to divide everything would be same just you have to divide uh, by 1550 instead of this 100 and 100 why uh, 1550 we have to divide because the c here c here here c uh this is inch and we know that one meter equal 39.37 inch it means see uh we have to convert this inch to meter that's why 39.37 one meter equal to 39.37 inch so over uh, here given in inch and if we divide by 39.37 automatically we will uh, get the meter see here 3.937 multiply 3.937 that will come 1550 it means uh, if we divide 1550 automatically we will get the square meter and the sm is given so rest all things will be same and the calculation if we do we will get the same consumption see the consumption 1.73 uh, with six percent wasted so that's all for today's session uh dear friends uh i'm uh, going to post this session in my facebook page you know uh, the, my facebook page name is uh rmg and apparel merchandising apparel merchandising and rmg and uh, uh, also uh, you can write any comments here uh, if you have any confusion you can also even call me so dear friends that's all for today's session and please uh, subscribe my channel and join my next session uh, to know about the a neat bottom consumption how to do the consumption okay dear friends that's all for today's session